That's very nice. Hi, thank you. Yes, we are in New York with Private Lessons member Mia Theodorakis. Am I pronouncing it right? Yes. Okay, great. Thank you so much for coming. Tell me, what is this instrument that you're playing? This is the smallest practical harp. It is a 26-string lap harp. It's called the harpsicle. I have sort of modified method to work with one of these small harps. They're portable. People use them for healing work or as a first instrument. And they have a great sound. They're made in the U.S. Wonderful, wonderful. Um, I have read that you utilize, um, in your teaching, you utilize a mode of kind of a modified Salcedo method. Uh, am I right? So he was a very famous harpist, uh, and uh, so he has a great following. Tell me about this. Yeah, so basically what Salcedo did is he advocated how you pull your fingers into your hand and and just a little bit more working with your body. And he was very into rhythm and very flamboyant, but I've modified it because I study yoga and I've modified it so it works with your body. So you're doing nothing that um, feels uncomfortable or that will hurt your tendons. Because you have to text after all, okay. as well as play harp. Okay, that's great. And so, but, but your um, teaching entails a lot more a uh, variety of music and different types of harps, am I right? Um, right, because styles. some people like harps can be pretty expensive and that's usually the um, the hurdle that people are standing against. So the great thing about this harp is it's like $550 new and you can do just so many, like they have such a great sound and you can go so, it, and it's enough harp really for about a year and a half and then you can decide what you want to do, whether you want to do healing work. Some of my students have worked with Kristen Turin. And can you graduate to a full-size harp? Oh, uh, yeah. Your... Everything you learn on this small right. lap okay. harp uh -huh. can be used if you want to go to a floor harp or even a pedal harp. Because your fingers, it's the same motion. Gotcha. But it okay. makes, before you go ahead and you spend 8000 to $20,000, you can spend 550 and have a great time and learn whether sure. you're really going to do it. Well, let's talk about your performing career because some of the things you do are just fantastic. So give us a sense of, of your work. Um, I basically don't say no to anybody who wants nice. harp okay. music. Um, I went to a lot of very fancy schools like Peabody and then I went to CalArts and there I did world music. I studied North Indian classical from Amiya Dasgupta and African rhythms. So I have this very wide expanse of what music can be. So when somebody asks me to do like a dance piece or improvisation, I can go to that, that space with them. And like I've worked with TV on the radio, which is a rock band, and I'm on the Leona Ness album, and a couple of commercials. And I've also have a show called Dueling Harps that has been at the Walt Disney Performing Arts Center with Anne Magnuson and my singer Adam Dugas. And oh, that's wonderful. Some of those uh, videos that I saw online are terrific and I Thanks. urge a lot of people to go to YouTube and see them. Um, Mia, it is so nice to meet you. Thank you so much. Thank it you. was a pleasure. And Should I give them a to... list? Let's bliss them out. Yeah, listen. Just out. like... to do anyway. Thank you. <laughs> sure. Have a great day.